and welcome back to the channel. On this video, I want to talk about riding your e-bike to work. So how many of you out there actually ride your e-bike to work, be it daily or once a week or once in a while? Let me know in the uh, comments if you ride your e-bike to work and if you do, how far do you ride? How far is the commute and then how often do you do it? Are you a uh, once a week, once in a while if the weather's nice kind of thing, or daily. Now I ride every day to work, but I have a very short commute. My commute is one mile. So it's not like I'm riding a long distance to work, so it's pretty simple for me. But I'm sure some of you out there um, that commute and maybe commute on a daily basis on your bike ride a lot farther than one mile, probably 10 uh, each way or maybe even more. So let me know in the comments, I'd be interested in see how many uh, do ride to work and how often you do it. And also, if you do not ride to work, but you own an e-bike, why not? Why do you not ride to work? I can guess some of the reasons. I mean, I could see not riding to work because the uh, travel is time would be, it's too long, the, the commute, and you don't have that kind of time to be able to do it, or just don't want to because it's because of the distance. That could be one. Um, I think a big one for a lot of people might also be the fact that they can get uh, a little bit on the dangerous side where you have to ride maybe your commute to work. There's no other way around it but to ride on a busy uh, road. And I can, that's totally understandable. I can understand that where you don't want to. Um, I don't have that for me and my ride to work. It's all side streets kind of thing. So it's not on any busy roads. And I can see where people have anxiety over that and don't want to ride in uh, with traffic. I mean, the other, the other um, reason why you may not ride to work will be uh, something like uh, there's no bike lanes and you refuse to ride at all in with traffic, or even if they're, even if you are riding, you're riding over near the uh, sidewalk, but you're maybe not comfortable with that because there's no designated place for you on the road to ride. I mean, go ahead and in the comments and leave a comment as to why, if you own an e-bike, why not ride to work? What is your reason for not riding? I'm just curious as to how many people actually do ride to work and how many people do not. And if they do not, why not? I got thinking about this topic uh, earlier today and thought, you know, they have bring your pets to work and they have, you know, all sorts of different days. Why not ride your e-bike to work? Have an, a designated day. I mean, if I had enough clout um, to be able to do it, I would start the, uh, the ride your e-bike to work day because I think it'd be a great thing. Just pick one day out of the year. Of course, it would be in the summer where most of us 
are going to have hopefully some decent weather to be able to do it and ride our bikes to work. I like the idea. If bikes are going to take over to the point where we're going to use them for a lot of things, then one of them would be commuting to work. This is a This is discombobulating. All right, here we go. That was a discombobulating situation. I didn't know what was going on there. And uh, there's somebody failing to signal. Had no idea they were turning in there. So maybe that's what we just saw there. Maybe that's one reason why you're not riding to work. The weather can be a big thing too. A lot of people don't want to ride, um, which is their choice uh, when the weather's not the greatest. I try to brave just about all, all weather, except for I wouldn't want to go out in a thunderstorm or um, obviously something like a hurricane or tornado situation. You wouldn't be wanting that and a snowstorm uh, unless if it's snowing lightly and just you know coming straight down and not windy and blowing and all that that's okay but if you're in a, a you know pretty good snowstorm where it's windy and blizzard like conditions and all that there's no way i would go in that but uh freezing rain is not a good one either to go out in. I've ridden on ice last winter. If you check back some of my, uh, I've done a few videos where I've ridden in uh, ice and snow, but you just gotta take it really easy if you're gonna do that. You know, I was going probably 12 miles an hour top speed. I just uh, did a few videos actually just wanting to show you that it can be done if you are careful and uh, I've also uh, ridden to work on my e-bike where like I say it's only a one mile trip though but I've gone where others didn't show up because of the conditions with their car and I uh, was able to do it with my bike Yeah, I think we should have a ride to work day. At least one day a year designated. Ride your e-bike to work day. I like it. I'm just coasting right now. I haven't hit the throttle. freeway stop here but I usually just slow down there's nobody coming obviously
little bit cooler out today uh, in my neck of the woods here. Temperature's just in the 60s, 66 degrees, so pretty comfortable though, I like it. Kind of refreshing actually. Well, that's going to do it for this video here on the channel. Ride your e-bike to work. And if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, thank you very much. Just hit that subscribe button. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up here on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified when the next one comes up. Usually, I say usually because almost all the time, it's very rare. It's been a long time since I missed a day, but you'll get a uh, video up every day, 9 o'clock uh, Pacific time. That's 12 o'clock Eastern time. And unless we throw a, a premiere video, which could happen one of these days here, that would probably go at about five o'clock i'm gonna say pacific time p.m eight o'clock p.m eastern time is i think what that uh premiere would be stay tuned there could be one coming in a little while we'll see on that one so once again thank you for joining me today if you want to leave a comment go ahead and leave it in the comments below and until next time Take care.